Hello, everybody. This is the Mad Salvi bringing you the news and all this other stuff that happens today. Um, of course, everything I have will have a little bit of opinion sprinkled in, but I try to stay as objective as possible just to put the news in front of you and, you know, give you a little bit of my take. The first thing we're starting with today is Doki Bird has just made a post last night, pretty much, uh, while I was sleeping. Uh, she made a post about what she's going to be doing in the future. One of these things is amazing what she's going to be doing. The main thing she's going to be doing is, she says, with everything going on in the VTuber community, I will be planning a stream on how my mind works when it comes to create content creation and tip slash advice I can give for those who are starting out or want to know how I do what I do. I don't believe in gatekeeping knowledge and will gladly be open to sharing what I've learned. I will not deny that making it heavily depends on just how lucky you are, but I will just give advice on how to utilize your talents and hard work to build a presence. I know I just started out as an indie, so I hope it will be helpful to just see what goes on in my brain and structures I have in place to help with being creative or nurture a fan base. Regarding advice for auditioning to a company, I can only give advice on how to prepare and present yourself, but nothing that will break NDA because she just wants, you know, you pretty much get a black mark on your record if you break any type of NDA, even if it is not enforceable, you get a black mark if you even dare think about breaking NDA for any reason, even if they are a horrible company, you will get a black mark in the industry and then you're screwed for anything going on in the future. I've always wanted to do this type of stream for a long time and I feel it's the right time now. If there's any questions or advice that you really want to know, please feel free to comment below and I'll look straight. I'll look through it as a pr I prepare for a presentation for the stream. The stream itself won't be something I can instantly do, <clears throat> but please look forward to it. <clears throat> The stream itself won't be something I can instantly do, but please look forward to it within the next two weeks. This might be the only time I let the public pick at my brain and see what goes on behind the scenes. This overall is an amazing thing to do for something someone as big as Doki Bird because she knows a lot. She knows a lot about everything from being backstabbed to being just someone that grew on their own because no matter what you are in a company, no matter if you are a part of Nidhi Sanji or a part of another corpo like uh, Hololive, Face Connect, whichever one you are, you will make it because you put the effort into it. If you are just bad at what you do, you might get a minimum amount of people, but you won't get a lot. Or if, like, you're, for example, you're just not what is fitting into the meta of VTubing right now, you're very niche, you will still have your community. The community will still be there, but you may not be as big as someone like Selen was. Doki Bird is right now. There's a lot of factors also that play in. Like, for example, she mentioned luck. Luck plays in a lot for that kind of stuff. And it would be nice to see, uh, you know, pick the brain of someone much bigger than us and pick the brain of uh, someone who has been in a large corporation to see, you know, not necessarily the inner workings because she said she's not going to break NDA, but to see other things that uh, might help anybody who's smaller who wants to grow in their specific niche because there's general advice that someone like her can give that will not be niche specific it will just be you know things like maintaining your your energy maintaining energy levels uh you know communicating or you know creating a community that type of thing this is just amazing for her to do i'm very happy that she's going to do it and she seems to be in much better spirits for her to be thinking about doing something like this so i look forward to it Yippee. this is v4 mariah i think which is a it says we know this letter is sudden but sometimes it takes people in different directions we wish biscotti the best in everything she wishes to accomplish biscotti is one of the vtuber talents that they have under v4 mariah it is with a heavy heart that we announced Biscotti's graduation for V4 Mirai. Biscotti is an adored member of our team and we will always be rooting for her. Due to recent circumstances, Biscotti will be hosting their last stream on March 10th. We ask that you respect her privacy and avoid asking Biscotti or other V4 Mirai talents personal questions related to the graduation. Please rest assured that Biscotti is in good health and doing well. Biscotti's YouTube channel will stay open indefinitely, though uh, options for Super Chat and membership will cease following her final stream. Biscotti's de debut merchandise and voice experience pack will be available until March 31st. Her birthday merch is already sold out and shipping from Japan at present. So they do have shipping. There is merch being sold. Uh, the YouTube channel will stay open, which is what Biscotti probably wanted, what they probably wanted. Uh, it says Biscotti is an incredible person to work with, and we're so proud of the projects we were able to accomplish with her together. Her art skills, creative outlook, and witty personality have made her unforgettable part of V4 Mirai. We wish her well in her future endeavors. If you'd like to share any 
any artwork and goodbye wishes, please use the hashtag slash biscotti, like hashtag biscotti. They are, this is the best way to do this. This is the best way to do this type of announcement. I wish that um, Nidhi Sanji would do this type of stuff. This is the type of stuff that a good organization that actually cares for their talents. I'm just speaking on, on what I'm seeing here. Uh, that there could, there, There's always bad moments in, in, in any kind of talent management agency. There's always moments when people don't do their job right. There's always those type of moments. So I'm not saying that those moments don't exist or to, you know, basically be like, oh yeah, you know, they're never going to exist. No, there's going to be those bad moments and there may be tons of those bad moments. So Biscotti has decided that she is going to be done with the company itself because, you know, people move on. Like what Pomo said, you know, sometimes they have school. Sometimes they have other things. Sometimes she wants, maybe she wants to go back to her past life. Maybe she had a kid. We don't even know. It could be many, many things. These are all suppositions. None of them have been proven, but she could anything. It could just be she's done and tired of doing the talent, man, the talent thing day in and day out. That's also a very valid reason, personally. So Biscotti, who is the one from before Mirai, who is graduating, decided to put out her words as a lot of people who are graduating on their own terms, unlike Nidhi Sanji, who are graduating on their own terms, decide to do in many of those cases. Uh, it says, Dear Humphies, or Humphies, or Humphies, I think it's Humphies, um, our time is short, but it's meant the world to me. I'll be receiving my diploma on March 10th and graduating from V4 Mariah Academy. Thank you for all of the love and kindness you've shown this horse. I'll never forget it. So Biscotti was a horse VTuber. My dearest Humphies, I will be graduating on March 10th as a racehorse placed in accelerated courses. I exceeded in all of my classes and I will soon be receiving my diploma. This was an incredibly difficult decision for me. I love the teachers. I love the girls and I love my time here at V4 Mariah that I considered flunking all of my tests in order to stay here with everyone much longer. I know the news feels sudden, but it's a decision I put a lot of thought into. There are many things that, that happen in a horse's life, but meeting you and becoming my hoofmies with you was a great thing. Was, a, was was the greatest. I'll never forget the happiness and time you've shared with me. I'll be returning to the forest, but I'll always be a gallop away from my lovely wives. I ask that you remain respectful during this time, especially in the other girls' channels, and not harass them. Their streams are their safe spaces, and we wouldn't want to intrude on that and make them uncomfortable. Exactly. Don't harass them. Don't even ask about it unless they mention it. It's really one of those things. That's the way it goes. You don't ask until you're, you know, you don't say anything until they mention it themselves. That's generally the way it goes in the world. Thank you for supporting me in my activities. I truly appreciate the kindness you've shown me. There will be an official announcement on the V4 Mirai Twitter, as well as calendar, calendar of activities leading up to my graduation. Let's make the most of these remaining days and have fun with everyone. And if I could be a little selfish to ask a favor of you, please keep supporting Petalite. I love them very much and will be always be their biggest fan. Petalite, I guess, was the uh, specific generation that she was a part of. Another member of this generation mentioned this. Petalite will always be four, but Biscotti took some accelerated courses and will be graduating first. Of course I'm upset. She can't, she still can't read cursive. So they're trying to, trying to have a little bit of joke in there. It's good. But I'm still really happy for her and love her very much. Petalite forever. And that's the, that's the picture that they have here. She goes and continues down here. I honestly, honestly, there's a million on my mind and I can't form words to say it'll be a huge change not having her at school and I'm not ready for March 10th because that's when she's going to be graduating March 10th. But I hope you always support Biscotti, Petalite, and V4 Mirai. And other people were like, uh, you know, other V4 Mirai, is this Petalite will always be four? Ah, your thumbnail. I wanted it as as art because it made me so happy. Okay, yeah, the thumbnail, she used it as art. Uh, Petalite forever. Uh, and, you know, other people were giving them a lot of support because the company did it right. These people did it right. It was not something that maybe even they wanted, but Biscotti was like, "If you, sometimes when you have to go, you have to go. You have to let you you have to let them go because you cannot be like Nidhi Sanji and forcing them to stay, even though maybe their um their contracts are done or maybe they just don't want to be there. They're not going to be happy. So it's probably best that they don't stay. But you know, some companies are black for a reason. And that is all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. Of course, comment down below if you want to uh, continue any kind of conversation. I am always willing to learn, constructive kind of criticism, all that kind of fun stuff, as well as my socials being in the description below. You, I would love for you to join the Discord. Discord is a nice, comfy place for you to be. If you so choose to be there, you know, we always try to be make it a comfy place where you can chill, relax, 
and just let loose vent all that type of stuff all those places are there thank you so much as well as a video on your screen i really do appreciate it thank you all so very much this is the mad salvi saying have a wonderful day today take care hydrate and take care of yourself please bye bye